cool? Science! Science you can do? Right at home. I'm just opening my door with magnetism. And going over today's science file. And today's science file, it says... How do magnetic cards work? Well, that's an awesome question. Try this. You will need a magnetic card, a piece of paper, a nail, and a file. Today, I am going to show you that these magnetic cards really are magnetic. And the wicked cool thing is, you can do this right at home. So I am going to sacrifice my credit card. And for those of you thinking, cool, I'm going to pause the video and write down your information. Joke's on you. The card's been deactivated. <laughs> Now, in order to do this, you gotta get a hold of some iron filings. And since no store whatsoever carries and or sells iron filings, believe me, I know, I've looked. You are gonna have to make your own iron filings right at home. So, the first thing you're gonna need, that's right, a magnetic card. Because without it, making the iron filings would only be good, you know, for keeping people you don't wanna talk to busy. Ha <laughs> ha! All right. You're going to scrape your nail across the file until you build up a good amount of nail filings. Oh, by the way, make sure you've laid down a piece of paper to collect your nail filings. All right, here we go. You're going to take your nail filings and spread them along the magnetic black strip. And check it out. You can see tiny nail filings stuck to the black strip. Now that's so wicked cool! So, why do the nail filings stick to the black strip? Well, don't look at me! Take a closer look at this. Magnetic storage of information started during World War II as a means of being able to record audio information from enemies. This was perfected by the IBM Computer Company by the late 1960s, as they were able to put information on a magnetic strip that was stored and then attached to a simple carrying card. Magnetic strip cards work by having tiny magnetic particles attached to a magnetic strip of tape. A magnetic system then creates a pattern on the strip which will carry the specific set of information. This information is similar to barcodes on products you would purchase at the store. Since these cards carry magnetic particles, the iron filings that you created will stick to the magnetic strip. A computer decodes the bar pattern and is why several people can scan their bank cards and credit cards and have the money removed only from their account. So now you know how key cards, credit cards, and gift cards work. You know, being able to see the magnetic attraction on the card is why science is so cool.